They have a 1,400-year history of going into a land and dominating that land. And we will either capitulate to Islam or we will stave off this scourge that is being perpetrated upon this nation. There have been 16,000 acts of violence around the world by not Nordic grandmothers, but people of the Islamic faith. In this nation, you had the Times Square bomber. What was his religious heritage? Islam. You had the man who was trying to blow up his underwear on the Christmas day. What was his Islam, his heritage, Islam. Right. You had people in London wanting to come over here and blow up jetliners. What was their religious heritage? It was Islam. You have a common thread in this nation, right. Fort Dix, and the list goes on, of people who came to this nation for one reason, to enact acts of terror on this, on this soil, uh -huh. and they were Islamic. Sure. Um, Haven't heard anything from Mayor Bloomberg in the press that loves the mosque for some reason can't stand the Christian center, but that's their problem, it's not mine. Listen, this is an, this is an evangelistic center. We are gonna be preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. We have one goal and one goal only, that's to save souls. Whether they be people following the lives of Islam, people who are atheists, people who have no faith at all, our only concern is to see people saved and come to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ. Just come to 911christiancenter.com. We'll be at the Marriott every Sunday morning at 11 o'clock. And let me just say this. This is not a message of hate. This is a message of love because God loves all people. Jesus said, for God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but shall have everlasting life. And that is my message, one of love to lead people to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ.